M0 FXB, just a quick one here. So you've got the ICOM 7100, which is now back in production. So I thought it would be suitable to have a quick video and just talk about the ICOM 705 and the 7100. So the 715 is all, 705 is also an all band, all mode radio, but it's 10 watts. The additional thing it has is a lovely color screen, Wi-Fi and Bluetooth and built-in GPS. They both have SD cards. They both have DR mode. Watch, if I hold that down, that's DR mode. And here, we're in DR mode here, and if we hit it, we're back into HF, and same goes for this. If we come out of DR mode, and we tap the screen, go to HF, we're in HF. Now, let's have a quick listen to the difference in sound. So, it's not... So we'll have a listen, trying to find a decent station. Now let's flick that across. 7181. You'll hear there is a completely different kind of sound than there is on an SDR receiver or transceiver. Right, so we're now listening to the 705. Obviously the scope comes to its comes into its own. And see how easy it is to see the band. Right, seven one six four. Let's try that. Swap antennas. So we're on the 7100 now. Both radios do not have tuners. They both have filters. Filter 1, 2 and 3. Right, see, and you can hold your finger on it. And you get that. Same goes for here. I mean, they're both excellent. Price-wise, and we're, that's the 7100 we're listening to now. Price-wise, they're about the same, 12 to 1300 pounds. Uh, since the uh, release of, since the announcement that they've been re, they're back in production, the price went up a little bit. But, you know, 100 watt here, 10 watt here. That, obviously, the 705 is completely portable. The, the thing about the 7100 is that the base unit is quite big, you know, it's... it's it's quite a size, brilliant for the car, and, and quite easy to move around, but not the way the 705 is. So yeah, both would need an external tuner. So HF, VHF, UHF, GPS, D-Star, I and mean, it goes on forever. I mean, the 705 definitely has more functionality, but the thing about the 7100 is you've got that 100 watts. So I thought I'd just show them together. Let me know, I'm sure I've missed loads of stuff. Voice record, speech, uh, you know, preamp, tuner, power, the way it's powered, the functionality of it, push that. RF power, mic gain, comp, like so. Here, push that, mic gain, RF power. Preamps here. I mean, it's quite good, the 7100. All the buttons are on the front. You've got XFC, M-pad, scan. You've got that in the quick menu here as well. Well, they both have a quick menu. 